What me. level did you get to uh, as far as basketball goes? Did you play high school basketball? Uh, okay, we being honest? Like, because, yeah, because you can find footage, so I don't know how far I can lie. Okay. Uh, <laughs> All right, listen. I played. I played high school basketball. I played four years of varsity, but it wasn't. It wasn't easy. Okay. Um, I wanted to play real bad. This is all I wanted to do. And my mom, she didn't want me to try out because my school was like two hours from my house, and we had to catch public transportation. And the tryouts for the basketball team was at 6 a.m. This is a true story. And my mom was like, "You're not leaving our house at 4 a.m. to go try out for a basketball team. It's all types of crazy people out here. I'm not sending my son on public transportation at that time." I was like, Mom, but this is the tryouts. Like, I want to be on the team. It's the only way I can get to be on the team. She's like, no, not going to happen. So because I'm such a genius, I decided to take all the clocks in the house <laughs> and set all of the clocks forward. So, so when it forward? was, oh, I set it forward. Bad. <laughs> so like, when it was really 4 a.m., I set the clocks to say 6 a.m. That's what time I was leaving. So like, wow. I woke my mom up and everything. Like, it was time for work. I got to get up. She's like, it's still dark out. What's going on today? I'm like, I don't know. We got to get up out of here. Time to go. I, VCRs, clocks, her watches, everything. I set every clock in the house. And I made it to tryouts. I tried out, and I was happy. My plan worked. And midway through the day, I remember being in class. You know, classrooms got those skinny windows, right? And I'm like doing my work. And I remember a head popping in the window. <laughs> <laughs> and, and it was my mom. <laughs> and my mom, and she was like, she just biting her lip. Like, <laughs> and I remember the teacher's like, Mr. Hart, your mother wants to see you. And I was like, don't, don't let me go out there by myself. <laughs> and he was like, go ahead, Mr. Hart, you're excused. I was like, no, 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 please, you got to come out there with me. <laughs> and I remember walking out in that hall, and all I heard us say was, you had me get to work two hours early? <laughs> 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 Wasn't nobody else in the office but me. She beat me all the way home. Every bus we got on, she hit me, had me on the bus with nobody else on the bus. <laughs> the train, I never, I think I got whooped. I may have gotten whooped for three and a half hours straight. And there was nothing I could say. And I was happy because I made the team. And she was like, Oh, you made gonna... the team? I made the team. And so that is one of the. One of the lessons learned. Yes, one, one of the lessons. That's, that's one of my life lessons. What was the lesson exactly? I'm going to be honest with you. There was no lesson. There was no there. lesson. No, no, no. 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 <laughs> it's called I Can't Make This Up. It's Life Lessons by Kevin Hart. And go see him in the very funny movie Captain Underpants. It's in theaters tomorrow. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. If you like that, click the subscribe button below, and good things will happen forever.